Hi guys, how you all doing? You are back with me, Daza, and today on Daza Does, we will be trying the Nestle Butterfinger. Um, American sweetie this one is, and it was picked up in the cooperative for around about a pound. The reason it was a pound because it's not from here and it costs more to get here and all that stuff. Yeah, yeah. So, in the bottom it says Butterfinger. Crispity, crunchity, peanut buttery. So that's, uh, that, that's fun. Uh, oh, that's gluten free. That's why it costs a pound odd. There we go. Gluten free, see there? So there we go. You can, you can get them in the co-op if you like peanut buttery, chocolatey, sweets. 250 calories per bar is a bit mad though. I don't know what a Mars bar that is, but that, that is quite a lot, a lot to me. You alright? 54, 54 gram bar. There we are, sorry, it lightens quite. How was that? Oh, ben. Um, so, I'm guessing this is going to be a peanut buttery, chocolatey sweet from the States. I've seen these before in telly. If you hear about these kind of sweeties, there's a few sweeties you hear about uh, in films and all that, like Milk Duds, Butterfinger, Tootsie Roll, uh, other, other crap, Hershey's and all that stuff. And I'm pretty sure that we have stuff. They, they hear about like uh, Cadbury's and all that stuff and fries and do do do. Um, Saying to the missus last night, we were actually ready to settle uh, down for the night, and I said to her, "Do you know what they call Galaxy chocolate over in the states? What they call it again? Uh, dove. Dove. That's because we've got dove and it's like body wash and shit in it. <laughs> Mental. So can you imagine going out asking? I don't know. I'll leave it there. Um, so 250 calories a bar, it's going to be a peanut buttery snack. We're going to give it a go and see what you think. Uh, I'm show you the, the You ready to die? Wow, it's quite strong in peanut butter. That's your butter finger. There we go. Oh, I'll actually crack open instead of beating it. No. Oh, it's quite, oh, it's quite crunchy. It's almost like honeycomb looking kind of thing. Wow. Didn't expect that at all. Wow, I thought it was going to be more gooey than that. Look at that, that's an orange crisp. Oh yeah. Alright, so it is, it is crispy, crunchy and peanut buttery after all. That's not bad. Wee wee wee! <laughs> that's a yee! So that's not bad. The texture on that's fantastic. It's almost like a crunchy. And it's not a, that strong of a peanut butter taste. Sometimes I find peanut butter very dry, but that's quite nice. Mmm. I was expecting it to be really dry and very stodgy. The fact it's crispy. Crispity, crunchy, peanut buttery. It's not bad. It has that like crunchy, it's going to tuck to my teeth. I won't show you because it's disgusting. Um, right. Down to business. What are we going to rate that bar at a 10? I'm going to rate it a 9 out of 10. My favourite sweet with peanuts in it or like that is a Snickers bar. Hands down, right? Now that's an American version of a, of a, of a American sweetie of a peanut butter. It's got no nuts properly in it, just peanut butter. But it's very nice. I didn't expect it to be anywhere near as good as it was. I thought it was going to be a dry <coughs> piece of shit. So it wasn't. It was really, really nice. So I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10 and I'll definitely have it again. But I wouldn't pay a pound for it. Uh, I think it's a bit steep. But there we go. So I'll have it again. 9 out of 10. What do you guys think? I think I've got a few people from the States and whatnot who watch this channel. Uh, so what do you think about that? What's your opinions? Or uh, for anyone who's actually watching, what is the favourite American sweetie you've ever tried? Let us know. Because mine would be that so far. Butterfinger. So guys, thanks for watching. 
For everybody here at Digital Dutch HQ, have a lovely day and cheerio!